Hello my friends, welcome to Top Classical Music. Today we will present the story of Symphony No. 5, created by Gustav Mahler. Symphony No. 5 in C-sharp minor, Symphony by Gustav Mahler. Premiering October 18, 1904, in Cologne, the work's ultimately optimistic colors may have been influenced by the composer's marriage in 1902 to artistically gifted Alma Schindler. Of his Symphony No. 5, Mahler once observed, There is nothing romantic or mystical about it, it is simply an expression of incredible energy. It is a human being in the full light of day, in the prime of his life. One might imagine that the composer, who was only 41 when he began work on it in 1901, might have intended this powerful and virile work as a reflection of himself, but in fact he was enduring difficult times, struggling through serious health problems and artistic quarrels with his orchestra, the Vienna Philharmonic. Soon, he would be forced to resign his conducting post with the ensemble, though he would continue to be associated with the Vienna Court Opera. Yet it was in Cologne, not Vienna, that Mahler would premiere this new symphony on October 18, 1904, for in that German city, his enemies were fewer in number and less likely to make a fuss. By this time, the symphony had lain complete for three years, but it was not until the days leading up to the premiere that the composer began to sense clouds on the horizon. Indeed, the premiere did not go particularly well for the music was spacious and challenging, more rehearsal time might have helped. However, the experience still allowed the composer to hear the music complete and develop his own opinions about his work. Mahler soon set about revising the symphony. He would conduct it nine more times in the seven years that remained to him, and each time he would revise the work anew. The last revision was in 1911, in the final months of his life. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.